good morning children welcome to english class in our last class we discussed the lesson bits of thank you friend today we are going to discuss the remaining bits of that lesson are you ready children in today's class we are going to discuss the grammar fun in grammar fun today we learn about nouns what are nouns a word that names a person a place an animal or a thing is a naming word naming words are called nouns children noun means the naming words the name of a person a place an animal or a thing are called as nouns example hunter here hunter denotes a person forest forest denotes a place crow it's an animal net it's a thing so the names of a person or a place or an animal or a thing are called as nouns in nouns in grammar fun bit g right person place animal or thing for these words here words are given you have to write whether the word is a person or a thing or animal or a place okay children i'll read out the question you guess the answer children first one girl now the word girl is a person or a place animal or thing come on guess the answer children girl indicates person so the answer is person second one rope rope is a thing so the answer of second question is thing third one deer deer is an animal so the answer is animal fourth question chair chair is a thing fifth question tiger tiger is an animal next sixth question park park is a place okay once check your answers children first girl person second rope thing third deer animal fourth chair thing fifth question is tiger animal and sixth question park and the answer is place next bit h h bit is one word in each row is not a noun choose it now here in each question four words are given in that three words are noun and one word is not a noun you have to circle the word which is not a noun okay children the first one is done for us look at the screen children first one first one the words are nest tree swim leaf the words nest tree leaf are nouns whereas swim is not a noun here nest is a thing tree is a living thing leaf is also a living thing of a tree but swim it's an action word so swim is not a noun second question first word winter next flying third word is summer and fourth word is monsoon so here winter summer monsoons are the names of the seasons whereas flying is the action word so flying is not a noun third question grass city river sink here grass is a thing is a living thing city is the name of a place and river is also a natural thing but sink is not a noun it is not a, it is 
singing is an action word so here sing is not a noun fourth one sister walking room fish sister indicates a person room indicates a place fish is an living thing but here walking is an action word so walking is not a noun circle walking next the last question zebra high mouse whale here zebra is the name of the animal mouse is also the name of the animals and even whale is also a name of the animal so zebra mouse whale are the names of the animals whereas high is an high indicate the height of a something that is maybe a thing or anything so height is not a noun okay once look at the answers children the words which are not noun are first one swim second flying third sing fourth walking and fifth one high next writing in writing bit k what did the tortoise and the deer say to each other when they first met complete the dialogues here when the deer uh, the deer ran into the forest and reached the three friends so when the deer came to the tortoise crow and squirrel what was the conversation between the deer and the tortoise you have to write the dialogues okay children look at the picture here the deer and tortoise both they are having conversation and some sentences are given you have to fill the remaining sentence okay children here the tortoise is telling to deer that don't be afraid hunters never dash fill in the blank what the next dialogue the tortoise said to the deer children hunters never come so far into the forest okay mm -hmm. next why don't you dash the tortoise also telling to the deer that why don't you dash so what it said to the uh, deer children why don't you stay with us why don't you stay with us so the deer said to the tortoise that i am safe now i am safe now thank you so the first blank is don't be afraid hunters never come so far into the forest next why don't you stay with us and the deer said to the tortoise that i am safe now thank you children with this we have completed all the bits of this lesson now i'll show you the summary video of this lesson listen carefully children the friends once a crow a tortoise and a mouse lived in a forest one day they saw a deer running towards them he was being chased by a hunter the tortoise told him that hunters never came so far into the forest the deer felt safe and the four became friends the deer is trapped every day the four friends met and spent time with each other one morning the deer did not come the crow went to look for him and found that he had been trapped in a net on the bank of a river the four friends decided to do something quickly to free the deer the tortoise is caught the crow picked the mouse up in his beak and flew to the river bank the mouse cut the ropes and the deer was free as the four friends were about to leave 
they saw the hunter coming. The crow flew up to a tree. The mouse ran and hid himself in the grass. The deer also ran away. However, the tortoise was slow and got caught. The deer's plan. The deer thought of a plan to save the tortoise. He lay down in the path of the hunter as though he were dead. The crow sat on the deer's head and gently pecked at it. The tortoise escapes. Happy to see the deer, the hunter dropped his net and walked towards him. The mouse ran and gnawed at the ropes of the net. When the hunter came close, the crow flew away and the dead deer jumped up and ran away. The tortoise was free. Hope you all understood the lesson children. And today your homework is learn and write the grammar fun bits with G. Write person, place, animal or thing for these words. And next bit H. One word in each row is not a noun. Choose and circle it. Okay, write these two bits in your notebook and learn them. Okay, children, that's it for today. See you in the next session. Bye.